Julian, uh, you know, congratulations uh, on the big win. Uh, speak about, you know, your, your performance. You really seem to kind of go in there with no fear. Um, you know, what's your mentality at right now when you're playing along that right wing? You know, we've said before, it's not necessarily your, your normal position, but how have you kind of adapted to that role and how did you adapt to it uh, today? Well, you know, I'm just just taking in the information from from the coaches and uh, from all the staff, um, from the players that play that position. Um, I just go in with a mentality that's just another game, and it's a it's another opportunity to showcase myself. And uh, I just I just take it game by game and play by play. Um, having information from from the midfielders, from from the right back, from the center backs, everything, it just makes it a lot easier for me. Um, I knew my job was to stay inside and not let not let any balls uh, be played inside and just play out wide and, and get there. Um, and you know, just uh, it, it all comes easy when you have a team like like uh, like we do. Uh, they support me, and uh, yeah. Thanks, Julian. The next question is for Scott French. Scott, go ahead. Hey, Julian. Um, I thought that the defensive organization we saw today was some of the best I've seen from the Galaxy in really a couple of seasons. Can you talk a little bit about what you guys were doing that's different, what it is that kind of made up that that kind of defensive performance? No, yeah, of course. Uh, I think I think we all played really well today. I mean, it, it was a it was a different um, different case from when we played in um, played in uh, Orlando. I know we came back with the mentality that we want to win and and we, we need to be better and. Uh, Everybody individually needs to be better, and we need to be better as a group. Uh, we worked hard for the past two weeks, and we knew our knew we knew our goal was, was to to win this game, and now we're focused for our next game. Um, and I know that just just practicing and communication and just wanting wanting to win and uh, play together as a team helped us out a lot. And uh, just yeah. What, was there anything specific that you were doing uh, in terms of marking or in terms of uh, taking care of space that is different than you guys were doing before? Um. I no, I mean for for me it was just um, just keeping keeping everything outside and not let, not letting anything uh, be played inside. Um, for the center backs and the right back, I think it was just um, playing one v ones. You know, winning your, winning our physical duels and and not not getting beat one v one. I know that uh, I know Wolf's job was was to let them was for for them to play out wide, and my job was for them to play out wide and for us to force them. Push them out wide and, and kind of double team them and, and win that win that duel. Um, yeah, I think that that was just the the change there. Wonderful, thank you. We have another question from Giovanni Garcia. Giovanni, go ahead. Your line's unmuted. Hi, Julian. Um, you had an incredible performance. You assisted on both goals today. Um, I was coming into the game. Not that many people gave you guys an opportunity. But what was your mindset coming into this game, obviously after you guys lost the 6-2 game and you being uh, the main focal point for, for the Galaxy today? My main focus was just to win, go out there and, and, and uh, do whatever I got to do to help the team get get a get a W, get a, get the three points, you know? Um, I know that's what everybody's mentality was. We all wanted to come here and we wanted to win. And I think it's the first time we've won here at their stadium and, and we're all very excited and happy. Um, I know our, we were we were really mad at, at the fact that they beat us uh, six two or six three whatever it was, but you know we, we didn't let that phase us and we came back and it's just, it was a new game we 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 all we all were hyped about about the game today and we knew that if we played together as a team like we did today and we had each other's back and, and we knew how we and we played like we knew we could um, we we could definitely beat them we were able to uh, fight for that ninety minutes um, I know uh, we beat them the whole ninety minutes and. Uh, if we continue to play like that, I think we, we can be anything. We have another question from Adam Serrano. Adam Serrano, go ahead. Julian, uh, Ethan spoke a lot about the uh, the intensity of training uh, this week. Um, can you elaborate on that? Just sort of, you know, did you were you guys kind of feeling pressure, you know, after the way that Orlando ended that six two game? Um, you know, what was what was going through your heads this week as you prepared for that? Because it really seemed like you guys were you know, very aggressive from the opening whistle. You know, you had your little uh, tussle with uh, Mark Anthony K. Uh, just seemed to be a little bit of extra intensity there. No, yeah, I mean, uh, the whole week was very intense. Uh, it was, it was a very, it was a hard week of uh, not. Hard, it was a hard two weeks of training. 
um, coming back from, from Orlando, we knew what our goal was and who our opponent was going to be our first game. Um, we knew that, that we wanted to win and, and come back and, and show, show our supporters and everybody that supports us and uh, our coaches, our staff, and, and our just mainly ourselves that, that we, we can play as a team and we can, we can fly for a 490 minutes. And, and like I said earlier, if we continue to do that, we can, we can do a lot. And uh, yeah, I know, um, like Zubek said, uh, it was very intense. Um, we, training was very intense. We were going at it the, for the whole two weeks. Um, it was hard, but, but it, it, it prepared us very well for, for this game. Uh, we knew that it was going to be hard. We knew that it was going to, it was going to be a, it was a, it's a, it's a rivalry game. So we, but we all knew that, that it was going to be an intense game and uh, the, the one that fights the most, the more is going to win the game. So, and I think that's what we did today.